Very good day to you people. My name is Mohit and guys there's some very good news for you. I've decided to give away a free PHP script along with the uh, along with the contact form and the form looks exactly like the one that you see in front of you right now. Okay. So I'm giving away uh, a PHP script which will fire off the functions of this uh, specific form absolutely free. Uh, almost unconditional there's just one conditional condition guys all you need to do is you need to go to my website which is adobe cs5 all right and uh, you just need to request for the same via my website adobe cs5.in uh, that's my website coming up guys you just need to scroll down and um, go to <coughs> the contact me section which is almost at the bottom of the website guys alright so that's all that you need to do you need to go down here and uh, put, put your name put your email address and uh, just request for the PHP script just fill out the form guys tell me how did you know act how did you actually come to know about me and then submit the request and as, uh, as soon as uh, it's feasible I'll send you all the assets okay let me show you the assets all the assets guys are there in my local site folder and I've zipped it. I've zipped it in the form of a 7z. Now what is 7z? 7z is just like a WinZip or a WinRAR. So even if you have a WinZip program or a WinRAR program with you, an application with you, you should be able to unzip it. And once you unzip it guys, you should get all these assets. Uh, this is the actual uh, form.html file. This is the PHP script which is connected to the form and which will make the form functional. These are uh, some pictures guys this is the background texture this is for the button and this is for the um, contact me form uh, background okay all you need to do is once you unzip this contact form and uh, get all these five assets one two three four five which includes these two pictures just place them in the root folder of your uh, web host your hosting company okay and uh, your form will be functional absolutely the way that you see on the screen right now okay and guys it is already validated okay for example if somebody puts his name here his email address here some comments here and then says I found you on YouTube and then says submit it'll give you an alert which says that email address must contain an email address so until and unless you uh, you know properly fill out the email address or let's say somebody misses on putting the name all together and says submit JavaScript alert says that name is required, email address must contain in the email address in the right format. Alright guys, and there's a request from me as well, right at the bottom of the contact form out here. Okay, just inside the border, in the corner, in very small letters. So, just for the effort that I've made towards you guys, it says developed by Mohit Manuja, that's my name. I would be very happy if you let me know that you have not removed it you've kept it as it is as such guys it's hardly uh, visible okay but I, I'll feel honored and you'll remember me in a way alright guys so if you you like this form please go ahead uh, request it I'll give it to you and also guys before I actually give it to you I need to explain something here you need to alter the PHP script just that wee bit let me open up the PHP script for you and let me tell you what you need to alter okay now this is the PHP script guys you need to alter line lines 5 and 6 now in line number 5 you have the email subject see what happens when somebody fills the contact form and the contact form is shot is sent okay and it's received this is the subject line that you will receive a new contact form message so guys you can whatever is there inside the quotes you can alter it you can modify it according to whatever you need okay then it says the webmaster is mohit.manuja.gmail.com that's my email address guys but you are supposed to just change this to match your own email address please go ahead and do that too uh, whatever is inside the inverted codes you are allowed to change that as well don't change anything else guys except <coughs> uh, I've used a background color in line number 40 you can edit this to match your website alright and also there's a message in line number 55 
which says this message will appear guys once the email is sent it says your message has uh, been sent successfully you are being redirected to the home page of the website or whatever so guys this again is something that you need to alter okay this message which is inside the opening and the closing divs in line number 55 you're supposed to alter that so also guys in line number 36 uh, once you send the form the form then redirects to a specific website in my PHP script it is being redirected to uh, HTTP colon forward slash forward slash Adobe CS5 dot in that's my website but you're supposed to change the website to your own website or any other website that you wish all right so <coughs> let me uh, take you through what you need to change line number five you need to change to choose your own email subject you need to change the webmaster to match your email address all right everything that is inside the course in line number five and six you need to change guys then you need to come down and uh, you need to change the website now this website in line number 36 is the one that is uh, once the form is sent there, there after three seconds it will be redirecting to a specific website there is the website guys that uh, you need to specify out here all right and uh, then you need to change the background color if you really wish to do so okay now this should match uh, your website okay but uh, for starters please leave it as it is you can change this message now this message is displayed once the email is sent okay again you can have your own custom message guys so all very good all very nice and all very easy guys um, so guys uh, that's it please uh, request the uh, script and I'll send you the assets in the form of a 7z file a 7z file you can uh, you can download 7z from file hippo if you don't have it file hippo.com or else uh, you can use WinRAR or WinZip. I think they should be able to unzip uh, a 7z file as well. Once you unzip it, you should get these five assets. Please go ahead and place these five assets in your web, you know, you, where you host all your files. Please place them in the root folder and you should have this form functional just the way you see it on the screen right now. And again, I'm requesting you to leave this uh, small message stuck in the top, you know, the bottom corner bottom right corner as it is so guys you have a good day bye bye peace